Hey guys, Thrun Still Gaming here with yet another video. On today's video, I would like to talk about Gotham Knights. Now, Gotham Knights, we've been quiet about for quite some time, but we have stuff to talk about now. And we it's Heroic Assault. Now, the Heroic Assault, we have heard absolutely nothing about since the day one launch when they said, hey, we have a Heroic Assault coming out, which is 30 floors. And it just so happens that we have actual information now. I was just doing a live stream earlier today on our other channel, 30 and Still Gaming, talking about I'm a little worried. They haven't said anything about the heroic assault up until this point. And now we actually have a tweet as of one hour ago. So it's about about 11 o'clock, 1130 in the morning. Uh, Eastern Standard Time is when they came out and said it. Now, it does say a challenger from the stars arrive in Gotham tomorrow. Don't miss the free update for heroic assault tomorrow at 8 a.m. Now, there was a rumor a couple weeks ago that we were going to fight with Datamine. We were going to fight against Starro. Now, everyone was like, there's no way that Starro is coming out into the actual game. There's no way that's going to happen. Now, just this morning, I was a little worried. I was like, what type of this thing is it going to be? We still don't know what Heroic Assault is. Now, based on the actual uh, frequently asked questions, they said that it's a completely separate from the main story campaign and it's a completely different game mode and i started thinking about this i was like well does that mean our because we're assuming that the gear that we have in our main campaign is going to come over to heroic assault and i hope that's the case but a bunch of us were talking about it in the comment section and then in the conversation in the live chat that what about heroic assault doesn't take any of that gear from the main single player campaign and you have to work your camp like work your gear up within the heroic assault itself now this is a good question. Maybe this is something that's gonna happen in the game where we actually don't bring our gear in from the main campaign and we have to start from scratch again during this actual thing. Would, would you like that? Would you like to have a separate gear, um, gear level inside the Heroic Assault itself? Because if we do bring our gear over, is it going to make it easier right off the bat? And you kind of just like, go through it super fast a lot of people have said that their builds they're destroying people left and right and it goes by and they want to kind of kind of play the game more so if you have a 140 character and you're just destroying people is this going to make the heroic assault much easier i would hope that they would kind of do something where you get gear like you have to respect my number one rule is respect the player's time and if we've put in our time for 140 uh you know level here to get our gear up and grinding for all this gear hopefully we can bring it into the heroic assault and they make it a little bit more difficult but we'll see someone brought it up in my live stream that said what about if it's like minecraft dungeons tower where you get the gear and then you lose that gear through that run so like you're gaining gear each level that you go through and by the time you get to level 30 you have a full set of gear and then you get some sort of reward or whatnot uh, in the game. Again, we don't know much about the Heroic Assault, so it'd be nice to know a little bit more information. Maybe they'll come out with something later today, but in their tweet, this is all they say. They say, a challenger from the stars arrives in Gotham tomorrow. Don't miss the free update in Heroic Assault tomorrow at 8 a.m. It doesn't say anything else, anywhere else, about what the Heroic Assault is. Now we can break down the actual picture itself. The picture itself shows four of you guys uh, surrounding the actual tube and it looks like you're protecting Starro from the Court of Owls. Now the Court of Owls uh, it looks like they're running around from all different places and it looks like you're in the Bat Cave or it looks like you're in some sort of underground where the Court of Owls is and it looks like you're doing an Overwatch type style escape where you're gonna be around the actual uh, maybe the things hovering and it moves. Again I'm just speculating here or maybe it just sits in the middle of the room and you have to protect it and make sure nobody touches it because they're once they get their hands on it, then you actually lose what it is. Again, these are just my thoughts. Let me know yours in the comments section down below. I'm a little more excited, but again, I, I still want to know the meats and potatoes of what the heroic assault is. And by this picture, it just shows us that we're protecting Starro and you see the Court of Owls guys in the background attacking. But what it doesn't show is how we level up 
if we're going to forget gear? Is it a separate, completely separate uh, game mode where the gear that we get in here has nothing to do with the single player mode and do we level up differently? I want to know the meats and potatoes of this game mode, but I guess they're not going to tell us, so we're just going to have to find out tomorrow. So make sure you're here live tomorrow morning. We're going to be playing this live when it comes out. It comes out at 8 Pacific, which is 11 uh, our time here on the East Coast. So that's uh, 9, 10, 11 o'clock in the morning. It's supposed to come out uh, on the on the East Coast. So tomorrow morning, we're going to be playing live right here on 30NSG. I appreciate you very much for coming and watching our videos here. Please make sure you share, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.